Down the down, 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 Man, just had a nice workout, bro. Oh my gosh. Just had a nice workout. Two men and one truck, man. Awesome company, awesome people. The crew I work with, professional, funny. A lot of, um, a lot of character, a lot of charisma behind them, man. It was smooth. Like, this was an easy day from what they told me. You know, only did like two hours, two or three hours. Moved some quick stuff in a um, condo, man. Scene retention is a beast, dog. Oh my gosh, man. I let, like, bro, if I wasn't on it, I'd be weak as hell. Or I'd be struggling. It was light work. It was it was a great exercise, too. You know, my, um, using a lot of my legs. I damn sure I use a lot of my triceps and biceps, man. It was beautiful, man. And when I got into that pen, when I got into the condo, the top floor, I was inspired. I made a declaration to myself that one day, in a few years, I'm gonna have millions of dollars. I ain't going on to know I'm in my 30s and be million. No, I said in a few years, I'm 23, 25, I'm gonna have millions of dollars. You know what I'm saying? I said to myself, I declared it to myself, I'm gonna have millions of dollars, man. I'm going to um, open up communities to help African-Americans. You know, damn, just giving, man. We're going to break them through. You know what I mean? Man, this, it really inspired me. You know, you know, put action to foot, man. Being out here, it was like do or die. And it just felt good. You know, today is my third day on SR. And instead of being inside or in home, you know, doing nothing, you know, I'm re I really came out here and, and got busy. I really came out here and got gully, man absolutely great feeling you know i'm not even on a schedule but i have such a good rapport with uh one of the bosses here he was like just come in tomorrow and we'll get you some work and i make 22 an hour doing this you know one of the guys i talked to i ain't gonna say his name but he makes 25 he's been here for a year but he makes 25 an hour plus he gets tipped you know 200 300 so i'm hoping i go with this guy and i get a I get a 300 300 tip or whatever man i gotta look let me show y'all <clears throat> So I get paid 22 an hour, right? So I work so pretty much three hours. 22 times three, that's 66, right? 66 for the check. Plus I get paid weekly, right? Praise, thank you God. Get paid weekly. Plus I got a, I got a fifty dollar tip. You say Lee's Grant, one of the greatest generals in history. He's very underrated. The president, after that piece of shit, vice president. Um, Abraham Lincoln had, you know what I'm saying? They um they voted they, they voted that goofy out. But yeah, man, legendary general on my uh, in my hand on my bill. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely destroyed the goofy southerners, you know what I'm saying, the slavers, the Confederates, the CSA. You know what I mean? So with that, that's like 116. I made 116 today. You know what I mean? Not in my pocket, but and then I'm about to do Uber and make some make at least a hundred fifty or something. It's it's crazy, man. Seamer attention, I really got you. We'll really have you out here going hard and going crazy, dog. Seriously, you know what I mean. So that fifty is just gonna be like it's just gonna be cash to have in hand. Put it somewhere safe in my car. You know what I'm saying? And just hold it. Not gonna even touch it. Just let the cash flow build up. You know what I'm saying? And then eventually I'm gonna get headshots. You know, I was thinking about doing a, uh, a CDL and stuff like that, but nah, I ain't gonna do that. Why do that? There's no point in me doing that. It's a backup short, but no, I'm putting foot to pavement right now, dog. Like I'm going, I'm going to, um, I'm getting my headshots pretty soon. You know, I know I said this week, but it's gonna be next week though. Next week I'm gonna get my headshots. I should have, I should have good money put aside to get pictures taken. And then, um, cause it's kind of hard to see what the next move will be because, um, you know, I got a lot of stuff to do, man. I got to get my credit together because what I event, cause I need to get my credit. Credit is so important, man. Cash is king. Credit is God. My friend says cash is king and credit is queen. Hell no. Hell no. But yeah, I'm getting my credit together to get that fixed i got a guy that i'm working with who's gonna get it together you know what i'm saying i gotta send him screenshots of it you know i'm about to uh go 
plant my clothes and take a shower at Planet Fitness. I'm gonna do some workouts though today. Even though I pretty much worked out for like two hours straight lifting stuff. But yeah, man, I seriously want it. You know what I mean? And I'm in a city of black excellence, man. I'm in Atlanta. You know what I mean? I'm not in the poor part. I'm in the business area. You know what I'm saying? Down there's poor people everywhere you go. And Atlanta, unfortunately, got them crackheads out here bad. Crackheads, mythheads, all that. But me, I aspire for greatness. I demand greatness. I have to have it. I want it. I need it. It's got to be. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you see people, you, see, you know, you see these guys like Jihad, you know what I'm saying? They they talk about semen retention, this and that, but they just inside. They ain't really out here doing it. You know what I'm saying? You see guys like, um, what's his name? The dude with the, I forgot his name. He was homeless. You know, you guys know what I'm talking about. Coach, damn, Coach something. Not Coach Greg, Coach, Coach something. But yeah, guys like him, man, you know what I'm saying? He was homeless, was tripping, but then found his way. Found his way completely. Now he's, um, now he's in the damn um, U.S. Army. And he's going to build a career out of that. You know what I'm saying? Me, you know, I'm working, getting money. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get my credit together. Eventually, I'm going to get rid of this car that I'm renting that I pay like $350 a week for and, and have a car that I'm like leasing, like a car note that I'm paying like, um, you know, three, not a three, like uh, probably like five to 700 a month for, which would be pretty good. And then my credit would be boosted and bolstered up. And then um, just a whole bunch of great things happening then on there. Then I'm going to be acting. I'm going to be doing um, extra scenes. And then um, side, I'm going to be like a um, side character. And then I'm going to uh, have leading roles, leading acting roles that are important. You know what I'm saying? Leading acting roles that are very, man, damn, damn, damn. Look, you can be on SR, you know what I'm saying, working out, you know, the basics. Getting strong, having... You know, not having sex with a woman or not masturbating, watching porn, things like that. Or, not or, but and you can take it up a level. Putting yourself on death ground, which is something Robert Greene talks about heavily. Death ground is when you have your back against the wall and you clawing up. And that's what I'm doing. I'm homeless. I live in my car. You know what I'm saying? I got a job, though. I got a job where I can get myself an apartment. You know what I'm saying? Or I can get like a roommate and live in an apartment. I'm on death ground right now where every day is a day worth fighting for. Every day is a day worth living for. Every day is a day worth dying for. You know what I'm saying? Seamer retention and Robert Greene's death ground. A strategy for absolute, <laughs> absolute chaos, man. Absolute victory. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I'm at right now. That's what I'm doing right now. I got a great job and I got this job because of God. I got this job because of being on semen retention. You know what I'm saying? I got this job because of a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? This dude really riding his bike on the road. Okay. I thought that was a woman at first. No homo. That's some dude. No homo. But yeah, I'm really out here, man. I'm really out here doing it, really not out here getting it. I'm really out here being the best that I can be because I know I can be. You know what I'm saying? I know I I can't become. And this is just from not masturbating, watching porn or, or having sex. It's just from these simple tenets, man. That's all it is. That's all it is. Just those few things. And putting in work. You know what I mean? It's such a great feeling. And I promise y'all, you gonna, you guys are going to see me. In a, like, I'm going to post a video in here in a few of me being in a, um, doing like the work, being inside of the, uh, the condo. And it just dawned on me like, bro, this is where I'm going to be at. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I really care for like huge houses. I'll probably move my, not probably, I will move my family into a huge mega house. <laughs> But me, I see myself in the city. You know what I'm saying? I see myself living in the city. You know what I mean? Being in, being there in the city, making money. 
You know what I'm saying? Because like when I my acting career takes off in a few years, I'm gonna be rich. I'm gonna be rich as heaven, dog. Nothing can stop me. But yeah, SR man, you bet you guys do or die on SR man. Don't be a don't be a fool. Don't be a tool.